dear friends, I wanted to give you a glimpse into the last leg of my journey into Papua New Guinea, so here you go. This is the capital, Port Moresby, and then as we travel inland, here's some of the mountains, and then we're getting really close is the airstrip that I'm going to land on near Ukurumpa in Papua New Guinea, and this is the view of the center where I live in the Eastern Highlands. So here I will show you a little flyover as we're getting ready to land. So that hill of houses and buildings right there is Ukurumpa Center, the Translation Center housing SIL Papua New Guinea, the group that I partner with um, to do translation support um, and to help this valley. This is the Ayura or Ayagum Valley and off to the left here you'll see the dirt airstrip that we're going to land on. So this is a really typical landing into Papua New Guinea. On the sides there you'll see the trees, those are coffee gardens um, and the dirt airstrip is where our operation has its aircraft and where we go in and out. We can only go in and out during the day because we're ringed by mountains and don't have a lot of external lights to help guide us. So. Um, this is our typical landing. I won't show you the landing itself. It got a little bumpy and I didn't want to make anybody sick. So um, I won't show you the landing, but this is, this is how I arrived into my home in Papua New Guinea. And then here you'll see a typical drive. Our um, airfield is outside of the center where I live, so we need to drive from the airfield to where I live. And this is a standard Papua New Guinean road, so it kind of gives you an idea of what it's like to travel inside the country and why air support um, is so important here. There you can see a group of people riding in the back of the truck. That's a pretty typical sight. And then um, off to the left and the right are big coffee gardens. And instead of using fences, Papua New Guineans will use these huge spiny plants to keep people out of their coffee gardens. Um, so here, I'm almost home. I think I'm probably about five minutes away from home. Um, but at least you hopefully get an idea of what it's like to kind of take my last leg of the journey into my home. Um, and on the roads and um, gives you a little picture of what life is like coming back into Papua New Guinea. I'm really excited to be home and so are some of the people that have been waiting for me. Um, I had a really warm welcome home both from fellow missionaries and also from my Papua New Guinean friends. As you can see here, one of my PNG friends left this in my little covered porch. Thanks for supporting me and partnering with me and I look forward to telling you more of what God does over this next couple years.